One of the things that Australia is most noted for, I think, uh, is the basic science, that fundamental searching after the facts, the why is it so, how does it work, that kind of science. But of course, society is very interested in the application of these new principles to real life problems in the clinic. The prevention of disease, the better diagnosis of disease, the better treatment of disease. And you know, when we use that phrase R&D, it trips off the tongue so trippingly, doesn't it? Research and development. People forget that that developmental research, the more applied research, it's actually quite difficult and quite arduous, and it requires special skills, slightly different from the skills of the basic researcher. And if you want to occupy that full spectrum, if you want your light bulb flashy breakthrough to move from the research bench right there into the Royal Melbourne Hospital to that patient's bed, you'd better think seriously about the developmental side of the research, R and 